What's up? What's up? I, the video gonna be about why does Baker Mayfield got all these commercials? This turkey ain't even right now. There, people want Case Keenum to be their starting quarterback, and that's a <laughs> Casey Case some Keenum. But I'm hearing people throwing shit. People on Cleveland team bar sky saying, "Yeah, cause Baker Mayfield, all these commercials, all this hype." I said it before. He's a he he's a completion and a first down run better than um money Johnny um you know Manziel remember money remember big money that turkey didn't last long enough he didn't even make it he he couldn't even make it as a water boy in Cleveland got his butt up out of there but but, but Baker Faker Mayfield all his commercials what has he done he got a playoff win but he ain't done nothing he ain't done nothing. He ain't in the conversation with Lamar Jackson or Josh Allen. So let's just, yeah, no, he ain't in the conversation. And Cleveland is stacked. They might arguably have the most talent in the AFC, even more than what Mahomes got, even more than what Josh Allen's got, and definitely more than what Lamar Jackson got. I watch. You got two running backs back there. I still say Kareem Hunt's a ghost in Kansas City because they need him and Chubb. I'm looking and I mean, you got a receiving core. And Odell is like the third wheel in Cleveland who's not really getting much of He's dying there. I mean, but look at what they got. And they got Miles Copeland on defense. Look at what they got. They're built right now with a legit situation. No worse than third or fourth in the AFC. Should be a perennial threat. To get two rounds without trying hard. That's how good they should be. But old Baker Mayfield up there always behind the cameras. All as Suge Knight would say, all in the video, all taking and all kinds, but he ain't putting it on the field. They were doing a side by side with him and Tua in Miami, who Miami's trying to throw Tua out like bad tuna. And there ain't a lot of difference between their two careers through their first 13 games. But that ain't what the white media whitewash will have you see. They'll have you thinking, oh, Baker is the second coming or what he ain't. Listen, give me old school Brian Sype out the old folks home right now. Or even um, Bernie Kosar. Because Bernie Kosar, if Bernie Kosar played today and he didn't throw no interceptions, he played right now, Cleveland would be, I hate to say it, they'd be scary. That's what they missing. That's what they missing. You know, in the back of the San Bertigliano days, that's what they missing. They, this cat gets all this hype, and I just ain't seeing it. So he gets all his commercials, and he ain't done, Jack. Lamar Jackson got MVP. Now, I can understand Patrick Mahomes getting all over the TV screens because he got something to back it up. Typical whitewash. Blow a white boy who's a little bit better than overrated, and they make him out like he's something. This cat is not seeing Joe Burrows because Cincinnati's legit and Justin Hubert. He ain't in that conversation, but he's got the money on him. And when you got the money on him, you're selling jerseys and all the hype machine. Heisman Trophy winner. They'll tap dance and say, oh, yeah, yeah. But he ain't that good. Faker, Baker. Baker is a faker. It's my thoughts and takes. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome, thoughts, comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind closed. Watch out for another. And I wish they would chill on this turkey. His money on him. It ain't got nothing to do with his football because his game has been, I'm out.